Hey, girls. <coughs> it's been a stormy day. <coughs> the bubbling book is bubbling more. certainly is flooding down the fields across the road. The floods are not as bad in our floodplain fields. But this certainly has, is now created as a bubbling brook. That's for sure. I am so glad that I put this in I think it was like five or six years ago it makes a huge difference or this would be muddy quagmire this is all wood chip it's rotting down but they're all relatively you can see their feet and their legs they're mud free She had fly strike two years ago, you can see, and uh, so she never healed. So ebony might not heal. There we go. They're wolfing down their nuts. Leaving none for you, huh, Inca? Nothing left for you. I think, I hope, the worst of the storm has passed. Got to get the bucket of apples. Here's the bucket of windfall apples for the yews. I love latch gates. Right. Yeah, it looks like they've cleaned it up. Their feed. Nibbling some of the grass in here. Now. Some just don't want to jump the gate. It will jump the muck. There we go. Munching on them windfalls. You're loving it, aren't you? Look at them. I know. She's bold, isn't she? Come on, little missy. Come on, out you go. Uh oh. Come on. Out of girls. Right. Locking up for the next feeding. This setup take a few, took a few years to slowly create, but it now work, makes feeding the sheep that much easier. And the older I get, the easier it is, or at least that's what one would like it to be. Isn't that right, ladies? Always making something easier is a good thing. That. She matches the woods. She blends in. 
I don't know what she's listening to or for. Hey girl! Something very important. I love how she blends into that woodland. She almost matches the trunks. The coloring of the trunks of the trees. <laughs> 